you guys coming? <laughs> a ragtag crew of extremely awesome looking people. Um. You come to find. You come to search. But you won't find, find the way. way. Why not? Uh, that if it helps you, you just might. I cannot help you. I only give the questions. I do not answer them. Okay. Brachus has willed it. Trompnoi must abide. You have met the unfortunate guardian of this vault. Judge him with a forgiving heart. Fate has been unkind to him. Do you wish to move forward? Yes, I do. Closely and make your attempt. Brachus is a bloody, rotten, thieving, very, very awful fellow. Some even call him a cur. A cur is... Bloody, rotten, thieving, very, very awful fellow. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. A cur is a C. A very... Awful. Rotten. Either you're very good at guessing, or the slightest bit clever. Let's, Let's find, find out, out for certain. certain. Listen closely, and make your attempt. Source is a scourge, a devil, a misery, a blight, a hex, a curse. And yet, the cure is... Uh, a hex... Excuse me, a hex, a misery. No. Yes, a hex, a misery. A hex, a misery, a blight. A curse, a hex, a misery, a blight, a curse, a hex, a misery, a blight, a curse. Perhaps you're not totally incapable after all. Or maybe Trompdoy told you the answers, is that it? Is he hoping you'll... It doesn't matter in any case. The path is open. Go freely. I know little. But you have proven yourself a knowing traveller. I will answer what I can. Oh, that's what is it meant to cure the soul. Perhaps Rex discovered the way. This he researched here, upon this isle. He could remove the source from any creature or individual. I saw the staffs he used myself. They were most. Brachus Rex has charged him, tried Tried him, him convicted, convicted and punished him. I know not the crime, but he has been sentenced to remain in this vault for Those all time. From entering. To prevent others from. Trompdoy was and is a creative man. He knew petty magic in his day. But this he has used to carve this place out from a simple vault, myself included. Thank you very much for your time. Oh, and thank you for opening the door. Uh, what do we have? Silver? No, empty. Bloody wine. Blosser. How much of these can I carry? Usually worth a good 50 odd gold. Um, oh, no, too high, too high. Uh, ball, empty cup. And you thought Rivalon was flat. <laughs> it is flat. The world is flat. <laughs> Don't lie to me. Uh. Decorative sword. Decorative sword. How all this stuff doesn't just disappear. What am I up to? 55? Oh, plenty of time. 83. 4 to 5, that's rubbish. 4 to 5, that's rubbish. Decoration of shield, that's rubbish. Oh, is it worth a bit? Uh, it's worth a little bit. Along with the... And you thought Rivalon was flat. Once again, it's still flat. It's still flat. Uh, a bowl, a jar, a bit of flame. Plate, a plate, a fork, a knife, a fork. See, it says a fork and a knife, but they look really, really shiny. <gasps> they are golden. They are so, so shiny. Uh, no, 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 no. Uh, plate, plate. They are shiny. Um Ooh. Crafted Bible read. And a whole bunch of new recipes. You see yourself in the mirror. It's quite a sight. I am very pretty. Um again, how much we're up to now? Eighty still happy with that for now. Oh portrait of a woman is worth a lot. Let's go for the ball, and according to the map, I can go through this door. Do you know what? Just in case there are any traps.
Oh, well, one of them's fake anyway. That was interesting to learn. Seems I can't use that right now. Ha! <laughs> because I petrified it. Just lol. Um. Very nice, very nice indeed. And another quick scan. I've not missed anything. Let's come steal a cup. As they seem to be shiny. Oh, and a painting. Gregor the Red. Uh, I mean, again, adds a bit to my weight, but I've got plenty, and yeah, he's worth a bit. Oh, the cups aren't. Uh, Necromancer 2. Good skill. Oh, our bowl's not worth anything either. An adorned belt for 9. Uh, what's he wearing? He's wearing a ribbon. Uh, 2942. We'll give you the unadorned belt. And then we'll give you a ribbon. Uh, let's quickly save there. Because I am sure I am not going to enjoy this room. Madman's Enclave. How did I guess? He's invisible. Um, you want to... Oh. Hey! Thanks, bro. I know I can go across there. Um, I kind of want to go up there with him, to be honest. Is that too much? Is that a bad idea? Uh, tactical retreat. Oh, but I can't make it. I can't make it. I definitely don't want to go up there with him. So, uh, let's start with the usual. We got a lot of physical, a lot of physical. Probably not that much physical. Oh, maybe I can teleport him down to me. Uh, what do we want? Elemental blood. What if you can get some kind of healing thing on the go with arrows? That'd be quite nice. Blessed arrows, maybe. Um, resisted by physical. Yeah, that's not going to be happening this turn, is it? Um, Let's just keep shooting for now. Okay, well he's an illusion. He is going to shoot me. How dare you. Uh, Bob. How can you... <laughs> how can you help me, Bob? Uh, uh, and one more. That should be him out of physical armor almost. Okay, yep, gonna with that. Thought he was gonna start throwing rocks at me. Oh. Yeah, I didn't really like that. Um I want to Let's use backlash. Let's rupture. Hopefully he runs away, but potentially not. And let's leave that turn there. Ah, you. Ay, 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 they shielded people. Oh, water balloon. Oh no, everybody's wet. I don't quite get the point. If I move away, he hits me. Um, but I do want to get him. Oh, well, I'll take this guy out first. And let's... Mosquito storm him. He's not going to bleed anyway. And let's put some healing... Yeah, I think... Uh, the lowest one is Fane, and I'm not going to be healing Fane anyway, so... Um, doesn't do any damage, does earth damage... Eh, I consume a bit of blood, but there's not any around, really. Um, cool, end that there, and then the guy who disappeared, there he is! Oh, <laughs> I sense him nearby. Kamehameha! 
How many turns does he need? Oh, he's cursed. He is cursed and nobody else is. Well then, I'm thinking. Um, that little cursedy old boy can... Take a hit. No, it's the range guy that's going to be doing all the damage. Tactical retreat. Uh, it doesn't. No, it gives me that viewing. Ah, uh, what am I saying? That? No, I'm pretty sure that stone wall will get in the way. Um, and I don't. That one, I think, came all the way around. Uh, that's alright. Just keep shooting, I think. Um. I really want to get him over here, to be honest. I think I might even, in fact, just delay. I want Beast turn, and Beast goes last. Ouch. Ouch. Stop shooting at me. Whoa! Primo, ouch. He is, um... Primo, Primo, ouch. Uh, heal yourself. Very nice. And... That's suppose that hits both of them. Very nice. I'll take some of that. Blue shields up. Of course he did. Run away. Run away. Run away. Run away. Take some rupture damage. Ah, yep. Um, I am also going to delay this guy. Because yes, I want beasts. <laughs> Who's stunned? Everybody stunned? No, just me. Okay, I can live with that. Beast. Uh, you're going to get smacked, but I can live with that. Come over here. Ouch. Keep coming over here. Uh, teleport. Him. Uh, yeah. Turn me. Um, and then we want to... What does Curse do exactly? Oh, he's slightly more beatable. Um, has a lot of physical damage. Oh, I could knock him down as well in the process though. What have I got left though? Two. Yep, let's do a bit of damage. Again, let's... Oh, I think that is... was turned off. Um, and let's knock him down. Very nice. Oh, gets rid of all the sparkles as well. Um, one puts me into electroshock water though. Let's... Uh, so what have I got? Let's give it a go. Yeah, that's alright. Gets a bit shocked. <laughs> Worth it for the backstab. Very nice damage. Very nice indeed. Um, pin down. Let's keep you right where you are, please. And then let's... Restoration scroll. Does anybody... Yeah, I should probably heal. Uh, what is that, that guy that goes next? Uh, I should potentially heal him. 84 health. Do you know what? I think he can do it. I think he can do it. Are you confused? Or do you always Oh, hello. Hey, do you mind? I'm doing hard work to take that health off you. Stop giving it back to yourself. Done, done, and done. As soon as you want to stop being electrocuted, if you don't mind. Thank you. And full armor. Dun dun dun. Nice few items there. You pick up the ring. You feel a cold, dark pain shoot up your arm. Your mind itches. You don't hear, but feel a whisper in your ear. It tells you to slip the ring onto your finger. That's not ominous at all, is it? Um. 
I saw my squirrel go across here. Uh, nothing down here. Nothing up here. And we have a vault, That's ladies and gentlemen. The soul jar stands on its plinth, glowing softly. Uh, From within, you can you see, hand. or rather, you feel a far off land. Frozen breath hangs Pine in the needles, air. Brush, Pine your needles brush your cheeks, and in your arms, you can feel a weight, a body. Then your vision swims. You're older. But perhaps not wiser. You march at the head of a shambling hook. The scene twists again. Now Bracca stands before you, a beautiful woman at his side. You lash out in treasonous rage, but you're sealed away in a tower. Your screams you're fill sealed, the darkness. You feel a jolt and open your eyes to see the soul jar before you, lying still in the vault. Your hand falls from the jar and grips the pillar as you try to calm your ragged breathing. Take the soul jar and smash it to pieces. A human spirit slips from the ruins of the jar. Decked in necromancer robes, she turns to you. My eternal pains, young one. Oh, timely death. The necromancer's memories fade to black, but the feelings remain. The memories of a Necromancer. No one deserves the fear and pain I felt. It one must wonder how many more lives they took. How much more? Ooh. A skill book. A purging wand. That wand. It hums Lady in a source. Chevrolet, Molodina, and Sir Buckington. How much does that put me up to? Ah, 92. Not much. Get rid of that one. And what's point? I'll check my inventory in a minute. Let's keep. Robbing the vault blind. Oh, purple. Very nice. A uh, bit more gold. Now, Commander Rask's soldier. The jar on the plinth before you seems ancient. The picture Place your hand on it. To life, and you're dragged into a dream. You see the lizards of the ancient, ancient empire, empire turning their backs on you, backs casting you out into the wilderness. Up into the wilderness. As you roam, the human apes turn away from you. All but one. One smile. Human apes. How nice. One opens his arms. One, one says, says he'll, he'll take, take you, you home. home. <laughs> one promises power for a price. He picks off your golden scales one he by one, crown stripping you down you to the bone. Got with shackles. You try to fight, try to reclaim what's yours, but a woman takes you, you to a tower. And he promised he'd take me home. You cry. You are home. She smiles as she sees the This is the where door. you belong. Your hand drops away from the soul jar. Your skin, Smash you it. see a shape emerge from the ruins of the broken jar. A lizard in the finest. Farewell. To the long dead lizard's Farewell. visions fade. Farewell. This is the price of pride and greed. One can't help but have a bit of sympathy. <laughs> what he did. Sh Shames his people. And let's keep moving in. Next plinth. This jar glitters and glows. From within, you think you can make out that with a jerk, your mind is pulled to a scene in a tavern. You see a dwarf in the center of the room, oh, shaking us all around, roar with laughter. All bar the zombies who are slavishly serving food. The door opens, and a tall, beautiful woman stalks into the room. She's flanked by heavily armed guards. You can't make out her words, but see the fear in the dwarf's eyes. The dwarf mutters a word, and the undead lurch towards the intruder, but are cut down like wheat. The dwarf tries to run, pushing her friends into the woman's path, but is grabbed before she can escape. As Such she's dragged away dwarf. to a tower, you hear her cursing Bracca's Rex and his whore. Even when she's thrown inside and the door sealed, you can still hear her shouts. You pull your hand away from the jar, your head swimming. You can feel the dwarf's cold t the jar shatters like glass, but a spirit rises from the shards like smoke. The ghost of a beauty. Thank you. My death waits. The vision fades. I've rarely seen such coward honestly. Making the dead do menial work sounds kinder than having the living. Being locked in a tower <laughs> was more kindness than any. 
Well, that got rid of a. F oh, hello. Brazier. Captain Zek Zapors. Uh, let's keep moving up this side. The jar before you may have looked opulent once, but no longer. Now it's covered in grime. It's paint. The soul jar rocks slightly. Light Gratiatus. from underneath its lid. On its rim, you can just barely make out the name Gratiatus. As soon as you touch the jar's cracked surface, you see a vision of Six, fine food and silks, decadent fine lechery. food and decadent lechery. But underneath it, the vision shifts. You see burning, burning villages, villages, slaughtered women, women and children. children. You see her, her purging wand in hand, 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 standing amongst it all. Laughing. Her falls across her, and you see a large, weeping face. She reaches out as if to comfort, but Bracchus drags her back. You see her fall into the mire of the swamp, trapped. As you pull your hand away, you can feel a deep, longing sadness in your soul. Is it regret, or just sadness for a life Slip. that used to be? the jar. What happens if I absorb the soul inside? As the power starts to seep into your body, you feel a force feel pulling a force away from you, pulling clawing at you, from, fighting back. Clawing at you for a brief moment, you're looking through someone else's eyes. You, you see, see a, a giant, giant statue's, statue's head, head and, and a gentle, gentle pull. pull. In the vision, you fall to your knees, you feel your soul drain away. The last of the magic seeps out of the jar and rushes inside you. Its power thrums through you, filling your body with source. Oh, hello. A source of source. The terrible vision fades. While she lived a selfish life, whatever a person may have done in life, they could. Uh -huh. <sighs> I'm. He trembles and seems to shudder with a quiet sob. I'm cursed, you know. Bloody Bracchus bound me. As long as the jar stays unbroken, I I don't rightly know. This was the source. And destroy you. But his favor was intoxicating. But really? He drops of to course his knees I before would. you and grabs onto your feet with both hands. Thank you. I will take retribution of bartering. Yeah. Wits and Hydra of Fist. Nah, not for finesse. Intelligence. No, I don't want those. Strength. Physical armor and magic. Plus one wit, 2% critical. Potentially. Uh, I think I'm going to go belt, though. I'm still a little short on belts, and so hopefully that does me good. Oh, that's been shattered. A little bit of more gold. Mikel Zoldak. Uh, oh, uh, fire rune and what looks to be a soul jar rests between two fallen columns, emanating a faint odor of seaweed and timber. When Fire you the touch jar the glass, your vision, you emerge on the prow of a fine ship. Your armor pulses with enchantment. Do your flag flies for Bracchus Rex. A tyrant who traded for your soul. Your flesh and blood is no is longer now. relevant. Your flesh and blood is no longer. The vision fades as the soul thrashes, trying to sever your connection. The light is where the soul belongs. This is a horrible, empty fate. You seek out Bracchus's vault, but the moment you reach the soul jar, he ends thus imprisoned. You can only dream about what is out of reach. Your soul and that alluring armor. The vision shatters as the soul squirms away from you. Curling up in the bottom of the jar. The soul jar pulses with trapped life force. Keep hold of that one. Uh, have I stolen everything? And all of this. Yes. Oh. Uh, what do we have in here? The deity's head and hands are missing, severed as if by a sword. You can't tell if this was meant to be symbolic somehow, or Look it a over with great care. As you take in its chiseled details, you have a vision. The statue comes to life and embraces you awkwardly with its broken arms. Oh, hello. Oh, hello. That shrine seems to have brought me here. What is this place? Hello.
Ooh. Level 25, with lots and lots of health and armor. The helmeted figure before you slowly turns to face. He raises his weapon, a great ethereal sword, and rushes forward, ready to strike you. The figure plants a foot before you, raises his sword, and commands... Fight! Stop this madness. The figure charges you head on ready to plunge the sword into your chest. As he charges, he suddenly evaporates into the ether, passing through your body. Deep, dark cold blooms in every particle of your body. The figure materializes behind you and grabs your head with one hand, pressing his sword to your throat with the other. If you so much as breathe too suddenly, it will slice your jugular with ease. You... You are my champion? How I wasted my efforts saving you as the ship went down. Drowning, you owe him your thanks. Why should I do as you say? You were so easy to best. Swing your head back, slicing your neck along the blade, and slam the back of your head against his face. You wouldn't have been caught off guard. Time you made more his clip. He hit him in the face. Holding his nose, the wound on your neck quickly knits together. He smiles. You may do well after all. Oh, and say auto lightning which means for making any assumptions. Turn him time for mysteries is over. Recognize me. You are my champion, and I am your god. Yeah, well you're kinda weedy compared to the rest. He lifts his visor. Two deep green eyes fix you in their stare. In an instant, God of all humans. Rap, god of all humans. Why have you left Rivalon Godless? We were led astray. We have suffered greatly for our mistakes, and our people along with us. But now, now there may be a way to mend what has been broken. I see a spark Do go on. in you. The beginnings of a fire that may blaze our path back to preeminence in Rivalon. This is why I've chosen you. To lead humankind Just humankind, what about the rest? Divinity. This is why you are my selected. My God Woken. Let Ask me what he means. A great surge of power arrests your heart, your mind. When it passes, you feel ecstatic, replete. So you may have noticed I've tried to help you on your journey. I blessed the water beneath your feet so that it would aid you. Now you have the power for yourself. And this is only the beginning. More and greater powers await you, if only you will seek them. Only one like you. Can wield them. One okay. marked for greatness. One who can either rise to this great task or let his people fall to ruin. No pressure. Your purpose will be great, but the first step is simple. Escape the grasp of those who would do you harm. You and you alone must safely leave this place. You and you alone must rise above the reach of minor people. Raddick visibly bristles at the mention of your companions. I am not the only of the seven seeking a champion. He is not a trusting sort. Your friends may have been similarly summoned by powers that threaten the very existence of our race. Uh -huh. He casts his gaze over the war below, where God fights God in a relentless, bloodless battle. Times have changed. The gods are at war. The victor will choose the terms of peace. If we fail, a father knows when he may trust in his children, and when he must intervene. I know that you will succeed, if you choose it. Do not disappoint me. Okay. Uh, hi. You hear a sharp chittering from the ground. It seems your squirrel, <laughs> after a quick back and forth, the squirrel throws up its paws, and you feel a strange new power fill your body. The squirrel sits back <laughs> and the cat I stops squirrel away. is arguing with the undead cat. Um, okay. Sibyl is pensively tracing a new name on her arm. Gilded letters in an ancient alphabet. Sure, it's nothing really. 
My own name. A little gift from Tyrs and Dilius. <laughs> Leave it to a god to be overly dramatic. Must be a celestial party game. Or maybe he wanted to teach me a lesson. If the latter, he has much to learn. I must say, I was hoping to enjoy a smug advantage over everyone else. Lacking skin may make me a target for mortals, but I am mercifully... <laughs> However, they and are infuriating when they get Though into my bleach. skull. I can barely hear myself think. Um. Ah, this is perhaps the first intelligent question you have asked. After uh -huh. all, one should always try to learn from one's betters. My people are a race far beyond anything that exists in the world today. And they don't exist we anymore. We seek to master the secrets of the universe. We craft wonders to last through the ages, long after your crude tools have rusted to nothing. I... I do not know. There are rumors uh -huh. that some have been found at the Black Pits. An oil field on Reaper's coast. I was trying to uncover the truth when I was waylaid by... But wherever the artifacts of my people are, I will find them. We have not simply vanished into thin air. There is a great variety among our people. Some are tall and Muscle, lithe. Some come in a variety of eye-catching colours. Some come in a... This is what makes you such an abomination, you see. You almost look exactly like every other human out there. Just as every lizard looks like every other lizard. What a nice Walking guy. Walking through this world is as repulsively bland as staring at a wall for a century. After a while, the very sight of you disgusts me. Uh, no offense, of course. Uh, of course. You put me a guard in the Hall of Echoes. Oh. Reattach myself to the party. Ooh, a switch. I wonder what that does. <gasps> Who would have guessed? Um, I came from this way. Let us continue. I have to find a Gareth and I have to keep exploring the parts of this island. Um, let's simply come to here. Let's simply get rid of some more poison. Good for Fane, no one else. And let's see what I actually picked up, because I picked up quite a lot. Um, it sets cursed. He turned to an undead leech to belong his power, indistinct malevolent whispers issue from the stone. Uh, one handed axe. Oh, that's actually quite good. How does that compare? Much better. Sets one wits as well. I shall take that, and that becomes sellable. Uh, <laughs> I will give that instead, and that becomes sellable. Uh, potentially keep those gloves. Yes, you can have those gloves, and I think they become sellable. Yes, they've all got better stuff. Uh, identify. Oh. Screaming Widow. Uh, throwing knives. You should be able to learn that. Uh, supernova. I don't think you can, can you? No. Let's give that to Seville anyway. Purging Wand. Salable. Identify. Thirteen Toes Sandals. Intelligence 11. So that leaves one person, which is him. Uh, and it is better. Also gives me plus one sneaking. Because, you know, that'd be useful. Heart of the Tyrant. Let me see my last piece of Tyrant armor. Curse me. So, no. Uh, Sal. Rune. And Captain Zex Soldier. Mostly sellable stuff. Unless there's anything... Oh, there is. Uh, give that to... Add to Hopper. No. Give to Bob. That's what I'm after. Uh, that can go to Bob as well. Leggings. Constitution. Retribution. 419 requires... Yep, Intelligence 11. May as well. 
12 oh he's the only one not wearing a belt uh, although I think are you still my winning barterer no he is ah fantastic so all the sellable stuff may as well in fact go to him send us a bill uh, beast 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 and let's go and sell all of this it turns out now Beast is my intelligence 11. I don't know if anyone else can even wear these. Nope. 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 And send to Beast. 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 Ah, the joy of organizing an RPG. Ba -ba -da, ba -da -ba -da. Oh, and I also do believe that it is time to go and rob everybody. Uh, beast, 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 sort by type, organize those please. As I said, let's go do a quick bit of selling. Hopefully she's not that way. Hopefully she's at the entrance. Uh, although no, I think she's at the other entrance because that's how I entered the camp. Ooh, getting a bit dehydrated. Oh. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. Speak to him. Cigarette. How much money you do you have? Oh, a lot. Can you have all of it? Oh, one person. Christian Carousers, there is no current offer. 1,049. Even me out with gold, please. Except You have all of my truck. Now don't you cry. The birds are asleep. the sky. Take your leave. Sir Gareth, did you find any sign of him? Oh, very nice, very nice indeed. Um, let's give it a quick save here before I go and go for extreme thief mode. What do you have? What do you have? What do you have? Look at the skill books first. Uh, happy with those. How about thief for the tangerine clock? Dagger. Nope, happy with those as well. Oh, I save that. No, I won't bother with that. Oh, I make it. I'll have all six of those. I hope nobody interrupts me now because I've started. Um, no, that's not that good. Salvation armor. Yeah, I will in fact take that. A nice simple ring. Whole book. Magical leather trousers. Yep, we'll take some of those. Magical leather boots. We'll take some of those. Magical dwarven dagger. We'll definitely take one of those. And then we'll rob you for all the gold. In fact, I am going to take Cloak and Dagger skill book and then rob you for all the gold you're worth, which is everything. Oh dear lord, I can just... Uh, just, just after the lot. Uh, most of what I've given to them. Oh, let's take some empty potion bottles as well. Um, let's run all the way up here. Hopefully that should be far enough. 
Take your leave. Get running after him. Pickpocketed curses. Hopefully he doesn't start coming after me. <laughs> no. Is he going to chase me? No. Good. Right then. Let's come down and do the same to this guy. Uh, although I say that... Not that I think I can rob off this one, but does she have Someone anything smiles with relief at hands he worth... Ah, uh, pyromancer stuff. Let's not worry about that. Um, he works fast, checking... Come on now. Yeah, well this is going to be nonsense and rubbish. What does he have? Anything in particular? He has summoning books and some necromancer books, which uh, do can touch in fact. Does he know in fact? No he doesn't. I might take that book. Um, In fact, must he close one? Shockers of pain, blood sucker. Right, so I might take that book and then bleed him for one turn. Uh, plus one single-handed. That'll be pointless. Plus one finesse. That's much better. Um, that's pretty nice. That'll probably be uh, a slight upgrade to what I'm wearing. Hmm. I wonder if that beats a little the necromancer so I'm not too fussed about. Halon's Blade. That's the one I could have gotten to keep. Uh, nothing special though. 12 to 13. 11 to 12, yeah. Nothing nothing worth it really. Um, oh, I might have that actually. Uh, not really much else worth hathering. Hathering? Having, to be honest. Hathering. Um, and I'll steal his money, I suppose. Um, right, so let's start. I want, in fact, I want the Fiddler's Shiv. I will take the Small Masterwork Rune. I will take all of your money. I will take... Uh, no, I don't think that's better than what I've got. A scythe. Oh, a two-handed axe, and uh, it's only had a few uh, attributes on it. Uh, steady coat. Uh, yes, I will take that. And we shall take... Uh, I might even just leave that there, to be honest. Although, wait, some of these will be worth selling back, to be honest, to someone else. Um... Uh, unfortunately, nothing near what they're apparently worth. Um, I'll take Death Wish. I might even learn that one. Uh, supercharged. Oh, that one's worth even more. I'll take Rally and Cry. And then we'll call that game. Uh, run. Water. Please. Water. You come all the way up there. The blade is thirsty. Now what? Take your leave. Run! The seven what showed us. Yes. What the? I've been robbed! Is he after me? Nope, he is just cursing his luck. Shift, yes, I'm not... What the hell? She's dead? Who the hell killed her? That wasn't me. Oh. Well, in that case, I'll take everything. How the hell did that happen? That definitely wasn't me. Um. <laughs> okay, is all I can say to that one. Um. Let's be bringing you all over here. Do I have my last trader? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. All right, three people, stop blowing things up. Let's be turning them round. To have found this. Let's be going sneaky biggy. 
<laughs> oh, and a bunch of Ranger books, which I think I know all of them. Um, weirdly enough, I'm actually going to steal the empty potion bottle, and then I suppose I'll just take all the books and sell them back to someone else. Oh, and your 11 gold. Can't be forgetting your 11 gold. And once again, let's run like crazy. Uh, you can come and stand down here. Thanks, bye. And that is me successfully having robbed everybody. Has anyone noticed? Huh, there you go. Oh! <laughs> um, and now let's keep moving. Oh, hang on, let's quickly attach train whilst I'm still here. And let's see what I got. Let's have a little bit of organisation, shall we? Um, dum -dum -dum. Rubbish. Yeah, rubbish. Uh, beast. Beast. See, this is all the stuff that just identify. Thank you. Identify. Lawmaster level 2 low. Level 2 lawmaster and identifying glass to identify. Oh, no, I have no identifying glass. I have three identifying glasses. Um, but I don't have any lawmaster level. I only have one. Sod. Um, sod of sod. Uh, plus one pyrokinetic. Just to be honest with you, 12 uh, magic armor. 8 magic armor plus 1 scoundrel, 7 magic armor, yes, let's just replace Migo's ring. Plus 1 scoundrel, let's give you that one. To be honest with you, let's just, just, just start throwing on the rings for uh, magic armor, to be honest. Not really too worried about the rest of it. Um, and then. Uh, I'll we'll just skip all of the gold for now. Give that to Beast. And then. Know it. 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 So they can all go to Beast for now. And yes. I think I want to keep that one for Sabeel. Um, that can go live in Bob's bag. Uh, Fiddler Shiv, what have we got? Uh, yep, let's put that on the main one and let's put that on the second. So, Sal, Sal, Beast, and Beast. Plus 11 finesse. Yep, let's keep that on you because you probably have to do more movement. Uh, 10 and 7, or I mean, nothing special on any of them. 5 and 4. Um, let's look back at the stats 29, 34, 41, 33. Let's give those to you and then potentially give those to you. Oops. Uh, Beast. Let's turn my caps lock back off. Um, Finesse and Huntsman. So that'll be you. Very nice. Very nice. Beast for selling. Strength 11. What have you got for me? 27 and 5. Or. Uh, no. We'll get replace his, I think. Plus 1 warfare. Or will we? Give that to Beast. Then skill. Missing vitality. Then skill. Why not? Could become useful. And set those two for selling for Beast. 
that can go live with Bob. And split that up. Let's go for a nice simple four stack. Give that to Beast. He's now got seven, six. Yes, a very nice spread. Uh, very nice indeed. And then just sort it out. And who needs something? Right, let's give you some of that. Uh, crafting rooms. Salvation armor. You can have more physical armor. Select. Um, gear. Been warned by anybody? Yes, by you. And have you by any chance? No, is anybody? Oh, nobody's wearing. Ah, Heart of the Tyrant. Yes, nobody's wearing that one. So let's go for yours next. And what have we got? Fire resistance, air resistance, poison resistance. Ah, uh, you're not wearing a necklace. So. Go poison resistance, and then the rest of my gear. Uh, somebody should be wearing a ring of intelligence. That would be you. Insert. I assume yes. That counts as that one. Dodging critical chance actually. And then second skin. Are you wearing those? Yes. Second skin, insert on the armor, air resistance plus five, why not? Uh, done. That's all four of my runes that I own. Equipped. Move my shovel up. Uh, right. Quick save, so we don't have to go through all of that again. And let's move on. Nice bit of upgrading done. looks like a beehive to me. Oh, I have not robbed this dead magister. Oh, this dead magister was cheap. Four gold. <laughs> gold in a beehive. Okay. Um, uh -huh. Back up here. Back where a glorious fight ensued. Um, through my exploding missions. Let us come back down this way. Uh, let's give them a second. Let's make sure they come in the right direction. I'm sure there are plenty of things on this island that I have not encountered that I don't quite want to yet. Magisters, I'm sure they just died of natural causes. Uh, oh. Nothing in the tree trunk. Oh, we're here. Let's come up here. I actually know where I am. Discovered. Nope, can't open that from this side. Zalaska. The hooded man exudes a restraint. Be not frightened of me, delicate fleshed one. There's far worse than my bite in this quagmire. That's probably. Oh, it's the same as what I'm wearing. Uh, I don't need the necklace. Hmm. We will take the magical helmet. Um, arcane stitch. 
just worth a lot of money, really. We're stealing for that single reason alone. Plus one strength, plus one warfare. I want that axe. Um, but I'm not going to buy it. I am, of course, going to steal it. Why? Because I can. Um, yep. Uh, that pretty much stops me from stealing anything else. Let's potentially get I did want that. Oh, some quite nice healing potions. I can only have two because of weight. So I assume I can probably, yep, still have all of his gold. Um, walk away and come all the way back down to here. I am going to... Oh, what's here? Oh, an undead person. A decomposing swashbuckler. Perhaps I can even offer something. If you have the coin. I you desire you trinkets barely a inch? trifle. For the smallest no, of not started a fight, that's good. You. Barely a trifle. Why, the undead, of course. We rise. We eat the covenant will be fulfilled. Glashel Demisht Mashtim. Take a leave. Run. Let's get out of here. And I am actually now, before I go forward, uh, I'm actually going to go backwards. I am going to go get some levels. I'm going to get some loot. Um, this dude is not following me. That's a squirrel that's just angry, angry, angry. Uh, who has run off somewhere. As the squirrel does. And then let's quickly feign's Bag. Obviously they're useless to me. Let's stick them on... We'll get them to spill. Uh, that is, of course, going on your head. And that will go to Beast. And that, of course, is going to you. Plus one strength, plus one warfare. Love it. And that is also going to Beast. Uh, and that can then go to Beast as well. Doing very nice on money. Um, so what does it give me? Thick of the fight. Thick of the fight. Thick of the fight. Thick of the fight. Oh. And all in. It moved my all in all over there. Gain a 10% damage boost for every nearby character or totem, including yourself. The more, the merrier. Oh. Very nice indeed. Um... Close that off. Let's unlock that. Let's switch those back round. That's only temporary. Let's uh, just move the cat out of the way, to be honest. Um, oh, the squirrel will come back here as well. Bless can. Bless is going to be permanent. Bless can stay there, I suppose. Um, let's move those two further in. Let's. No, happy with that for now, to be honest. And happy with that. Cool, let's lock that. Let's obviously then give a quick save as once again saves us going back and doing that again. Um, let's go in through the sewage pipe and let's go kill some people. 